Hello everyone. Uh, let's start our architecture drawings. Um, let's start with our interior elevation. I am going to do a tree house. It's one of my favorite things to draw. And I'm going to start out with my supplies. I need a decent pencil with an eraser, uh, a fine point marker. And I usually use the Pilot Fine Liners or the Sharpie Permanent Ultra Fine Point, the ones that look like this, okay? So uh, these two are the ones we're going to be using, but not you just yet. First, we have to use our pencil and we have to do our drawing. Now, you're going to get your good copy paper. You can either use it this way or this way. It's up to you. I'm going to do a treehouse, so I want to use my paper up and down. Uh, if you're doing something that's long, like a bus or even a regular house or a castle, you might want to do it this way. If you're doing a spaceship, you may want to go up and down. Whichever way your building is taller, you'll use it this way. If it's wider, you'll use it this way. I'm going to start this way for mine. I have my good copy, my supplies. I need a ruler. Uh, I will need it at some point, I'm sure. Uh, I will have for you in class. And this is my um, transparent mylar paper that I'm going to do my exterior elevation, but I'm going to leave that aside right now. The first thing I'm going to do is I want to do my outline, and I'm going to just actually draw my ground. So the first thing I need to do is figure out where my ground is going to be. I'm going to put it pretty low because I don't really, I need that upper part for my treehouse. And I'm going to start with, I want it to be a little bit wider here, a little bit wider here. It's going to be a wide treehouse. And there's kind of my, and this is my good copy. So I've already done my practice copy. Oh, wait, I don't need that. Do you know why? Because that's what you'd see on the outside. And what we're doing is on the inside. So I am going to remove that line. This is just the outside line. And what I want to do before I do anything is I want to, oops, my camera's shaking. I want to do my outline. I'm going to make sure that this works well. I'm going to use this one. And I want to do the outline. And I'm going to go, and as long as you're happy with it. Okay, I really like the way this is. And I want to just kind of get this outline done. I'm not going to worry about the pencil marks now. I'm going to start in pencil for a little bit, and then I'm going to switch over to the fine point. First, I'm going to decide how many levels is my um, single family dwelling of a treehouse. I'm going to say I got a lot of space here, but I don't necessarily have to use all of it. I'm going to start with the bottom. I'm going to do one floor here. I'm going to do another floor here. And they might just be single rooms for that part. And then I'm going to get up to here. Now, my treehouse has a lot of floors. You don't have to have as many floors. I think that that's enough. This might be a high ceiling, so I might just leave that there. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is determine how many rooms do I need? What are my necessity rooms? Like a place to sleep, a place to eat, a place to go to the bathroom, a place to hang out, um, a place to cook. So, these are the things that are necessities, and then I get to do all my fun stuff. Like maybe I want an art room, or maybe I want a room that I can keep my lizards in. I don't know. I don't really have lizards. But just if I wanted to, I could have a lizard room. Anyway, that's up for you to decide. I'm going to make sure I know where my main entrance is, and I think I want to put my main entrance here. I think that's where it is. I'm just kind of holding that spot there, and I want to do a ladder to get up to the next floor over here, and I'm going to do that there. Now, this is my first floor. I kind of don't want anything on the first floor other than maybe, I don't know, maybe I will have, uh, oh, you know what I might want to do? I'm going to actually have a garage. This is where my car will be. 
So I want to have a car here, and then I also want to have a coat rack here. That's my entranceway. That's where I get to put all my stuff. Now I'm going to go up to my next level here, and I want to maybe do a split room here. I will do a split room of, let's see, I don't know, whatever we'll decide afterwards. I'm going to split that there, and I want to do my stairs this way. My ladder stairs are going to be on this side now. So I'm going to make sure I put those there. Now I'm going to go up to this room here. No, maybe this will be my kitchen and my eating area. I like that. So I'm going to actually do, this is going to walk right into my dining area. I'm going to do a dining room table here or a table, chairs here. And you have to take time to do your detail. That's the only thing I think you need to think about is you need time to do the detail. And my kitchen's going to be pretty basic. I just want to show things um, that are like a sink. You don't have to do three-dimensional. Uh, you can just kind of give the idea of what it is. And I'm going to have a counter here. And I'm going to do my oven here. There is my kitchen. There's my dining room. And I'm going to head up and maybe do a lounge room here. So I think that... I want to do kind of like a big TV over here. I want to put the stairs on this side now. A couch over here. There's my couch. I want to have a big TV over here. Let's just kind of put it on the wall with a little console here. And maybe I'll put a rug here. And I think that's enough for... Um, maybe I want... Oh, you know what I forgot? I love a chandelier in my dining room for light. I love that. Okay, so there's my chandelier for light. And in here, maybe I'll have a window in my kitchen. So there's a window in my kitchen. I don't know where it is in a tree house, but it's just the idea of it. So I have those rooms. Now I'm going to go back up on this side. Now this is going to be tricky because I think I'm going to have to do the stairs in the middle here. And what I'm going to do is this is going to be divided into two separate areas. I want to have my, this is going to be kind of like um, a floor here a partial here floor here or maybe this will just be storage space and it'll just be dead space here it'll be storage space this is going to be maybe my art studio so I'm going to draw an easel here with a painting on it oops and I want to have a little table with my paintbrushes in it and let me just kind of draw something abstract there. And let's see what else I can put in here. Let's see what I want to do. So that's my art studio. I still need a bathroom and a place to sleep. So what I'm going to do right here is I actually want this other side to be my library. This is actually going to be where all my books go. So I'm going to have these crazy shelves here with all my books. And these are going to be my books. And I'm going to have a ladder here for my bookshelf to get to, a small ladder. And then for this area, I think I want to have uh, my plants. So I think I want this to be like a little bit of a garden center where I have all these you know hanging plants and they're growing down these are my plants and then i have another basket and that goes like that and that goes like that and then i have more plants growing down And there's leaves on it and I can fix that up later and then here I have my all my plant shelves and I have all these plants on here and 
And I have some little plants here. So there's my plant room, and I actually want to put a painting on this wall here. And you can see I'm adding a lot of detail. And I'm going to maybe do something up. We'll figure that out. And as I go up, I'm going to do my bedroom. And uh, let's put the stairs over here now. We're going to put the stairs over here, and they're going to go here. And this is just going to be like... I have a great idea. This is going to be a, you know what? I'm taking this out. I'm doing a crazy slide from here. There is going to be a slide to get to this floor. That's what this is. It's a slide. So you basically go in here and you go out here. So there's a slide here. I want my bedroom to be here now with my bathroom. So I'm going to put my bathroom right over here. And I might take this garage away. I don't know if I want a garage here. And I'm going to put actually a small bathroom here with no shower, just a toilet and a sink. Okay. And here's my sink. And there's a bathroom there because, you know, that's a far way to go to get to a bathroom up here. So this one is going to have a shower. So we're going to do a shower head. And then here's the bathroom shower. And here is the sink. And here is my lovely toilet okay so there's my bathroom and this is my bedroom and I'm gonna draw and have a nice bed here I think this video is going on way too long and I might speed up a lot part a lot of parts of this but I just want you to see where I'm at with this have a pillow here, a pillow here, and I might do another light. I'm going to do a table there with a lamp on it, and I might have a carpet here, and I might have a little couch here in my room, because I've always wanted a couch, and I'm going to actually put a TV here. We're going to put a TV uh, on this. And, uh, yeah, I think that looks good. I think I want that for my bedroom, but I want to put a closet in here or maybe like some storage right there to put my clothes and things. So that's my bedroom. Now up here, I can do whatever I want and I'll get to that. But right now, the next thing you're going to do after you design it and you add enough detail, you're going to go over it with your fine liner carefully. And it's just the inside stuff. I'm gonna do something really crazy up here afterwards, but I wanna see you start to do this. And it'll take some time, but you're gonna go over it. And after you go over it, what you're gonna do is you're going to let it dry and then you're going to erase all that pencil marks. So, and there's no color to this. This is all black and white, okay? So I want you to get going on this, add detail, think about what you're doing. Don't worry if it's not perfect, it doesn't have to be. And just do your best and have fun, okay?